All right, beautiful day here. I'm going island hopping today. I'm uh, still in uh, Siergau Island and the plan is to visit uh, three different islands now. All of them uh, along the coast here. Hello, are you the boatman? Okay, what's your name? Nisto. Okay, nice to meet you. So, oh, it's a shaky boat, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Don't shake it too much. In the past days, it was actually uh, raining here a lot. Mm -hmm. So this is the first day after a few days where we have good weather. Yeah, genau. So the perfect, uh, yeah, genau. You speak German, actually. Yeah. That's funny. You live in Germany. Yeah, genau. Uh, in, 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 but in you're Filipino. Island. Yeah. Exactly. Genau. <laughs> so. Exactly. I met a Filipino who speaks German. That's actually quite funny. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we made it to the first island and check out the water here, guys. Oh, and the views here, sun shining, clear water. Oh, this is like a paradise and yeah, I booked this tour like very spontaneously, like half an hour ago. And I, I'm not really sure what's the plan. I think the plan is we're going to hop to several islands. And then on one island, we also have like lunch later. So I'm excited. What was the name of this island again? Naked. Naked Island. Yeah, I guess you have to go naked. We have to go uh, naked now? <laughs> yeah. Okay. No, 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 they call it naked because um, there's nothing in here. It's because like, it's just a sandbar, right? It's yeah, not really an island here. It's a naked island. Yeah. Basically, that's it. That's the whole reason why they call it naked. Where in the Philippines are you from? Cebu. Cebu. No, I, I grew up everywhere. Yeah, but everywhere. Pero I'm Visaya. I speak Visaya. Oh, Visaya. Yeah, okay. that's, that's my first language. Uh -huh. He's speaking Deutsch. And he speaks Deutsch. He speaks German as well. <laughs> that's so funny for me. I never met a Filipino before who speaks German. Actually, yeah. your German is quite okay. Nine. It's, so, it, it's okay. It's, it's a couple. <laughs> yeah, but of course, I can hear you have an accent, but actually, yeah, yeah. It's, it's totally understandable. Oh, okay. So, better than my uh, Tagalog. No, because I'm very insecure with my language, that's why. You're insecure? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay, but I, as a German, I uh, say that you speak with German. Thank you. Thank you. There's somebody flying a drone here. Actually, there's another, here. there's another drone here. So, yeah, this is a tourist uh, tour. So, you see many tourists here, all these. Uh, boats here that are making stops here all day so now we have this side with absolutely no people here this is uh, what you think of when you think of paradise right blue water sunshine blue sky and doing an island hopping tour here in the Philippines absolutely beautiful and yeah we spent now like half an hour here there's not really that much to do as you can see and it's also no shade here so it's getting pretty hot but uh, off to the next one, which I think is the one in the background over there. Oh, and by the way, I will tell you the price for a tour like this uh, and my opinion if it's worth it or not at the end of the video, at the end of the tour. All right, off to the next one. Right. We have made it to the next island yeah. called Dark, I think Darku Island. Darku Island? What does Darku mean? Big island. Big island? Ah, so this is the big island. Yeah, it looks nice here. What is the food place? Is it over here? The food? Ah, yeah. Yeah. Sure. Is it over here? Or there? There, there. That's why. That guy is like book or dinner? Ah, yeah, they have book. Oh. What are they catching here? Um, those are shells. Shells? Yeah, you can mm -hmm. eat that. It's really good. What are what? Why they catch it? They probably will sell it or hello. Oh. Oh. So they catch uh, shells here. Unsa ba na? Unsa baligya? Ibaligya din yun eh? Baligya or kaon don niyo? Yeah, they're going to sell it and some they're going to eat it. Also, oh, they live here on the island? Taga Oh, yeah. Taga means from, right? Taga, Taga, oh. Taga. So I know it, Taga Germany. Ako. Taga Germany. Ka. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> taga Deri sila. Taga oh. Deri is here. Deri is here, okay. Taga Deri? Yeah. Taga Deri. Ako Taga Deri. Oh, you're from here. I'm ako? from here. <laughs> taga. Oh, how do you say you? Ikao. Ikao. Ikao Dari. 
Gapuyo. Gapuyo? From this island? Yeah. Ah, okay. Ikaw, Ikaw? Deri Gapuyo. Uh. Ikaw, Taga Deri. But this is uh, Bisaya. I'm learning yeah. Bisaya now. Bisaya. Okay, okay. Still in the part of the Philippines where they speak Bisaya. Okay, there's a little uh, market here maybe. So I think we will choose fresh fish now and then they cook it for us. Oh, it smells good in here already. So uh, we can choose what we would like to eat and then they prepare? Yeah. yeah. Oh. So they're going to grill it for us. Oh, okay. That's what they're doing right now. Ah, oh, the grill is already full here. Check it out, guys. Oh, big fish is here. Mm. I see even chicken on the grill here. Some uh, squid, I think. Mm. So, do you want the Filipino way, the budo fight? Like, where they're, yeah, they're going to serve it in a. That sounds nice, yeah. They're, they're going to serve it in a banana leaf. Yeah, I heard about that before. Huh? I heard about bottle bottle fight, right? Uh, let's have it the Filipino way. Yeah, yeah. sure, sure. Okay, let's oh, so what, what are we choosing? Is there a menu? There's no menu. Uh, the menu is basically there. We just have to choose. The menu is uh, basically looking at the food and then okay. deciding what you we want. We can like bite together. <laughs> we can just like spin it. Uh, is a grill. Tapos ito is thin. So we have fish uh -huh. here. Tapos yung ito crab is garlic. Garlic. Tapos yung shrimp kanan din. Sige, anak na lang. So on on sa mga isda yung yung gusto. Okay, you guys choose what kind what kind of fish like would you guys? Kano bakong? Kani. 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 It's, it's, is it uh, tuna, all of it? Oh, no, tuna. Tuna, 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 tuna would be nice. I would like to try tuna. Yeah, okay, actually. let's have a tuna. Let's get a tuna. And some calamari. Repeat, okay. For 50. So we'll have two fish, I guess. Yeah. I think two fish is good for, for, yeah, for, for the four of us. Yes. Okay. Then we'll, we'll get this one. Well, what is this one? 30, 35 pieces. 350. 350. Yeah, that's okay. Well, what is it? I don't know. What the, uh, oh, oh, that's really good. Shall okay, we will try it as well. Some, some squid. Okay, mm. well, that's good. Oh, guys, it smells so good yeah. in here. Everything freshly on the grill. Oh, this is going to be an amazing experience, I think. Oh, there's a dog walking by here as well. Oh, I'm excited. Okay, so this looks absolutely uh, beautiful here, right, guys? Wow. And here we are getting one of these huts. They charge 350 if you want to get a hut. So this is our hut. Ah, okay. With the view over the ocean. It's been over an hour since we ordered our food. So don't get me wrong, we're enjoying the time here, but I'm curious what's going on. So let's investigate a little bit what's up with our food. Actually, the island gets pretty busy now. Like every hut is now taken. Lots of uh, tours arriving here, all the tour boats full with tourists. So I guess the kitchen is a little bit busy now. But let's have a look. Oh. Are they preparing food here? Hello. Hello. So this looks like a really big one. Hello. 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 Oh. That looks really good. <laughs> so I think we are getting a table like this as well. Full with all the, the food. I'm wondering uh, our food. Huh? Oh. I'm just uh, wondering uh, how many minutes it needs. <laughs> <laughs> what is she? What is she saying? Ah, this is for us. Yeah. Ah, okay, okay, nice. Okay. Twenty minutes, bro. Okay, that's okay. We're not in a rush. I was just uh, curious. Ah, so this is for us. Yes, sir. Ah, okay. A little bit, yeah. Ah, you make uh, the word Shia Gao? Yeah. Oh, okay. Ah. Okay. And I'm looking forward to try it. Oh, this is a, for how many people is this? Eight people. Eight people? Oh, yeah, that's a lot of food. So, fish, fruits, rice, noodles, shrimp, everything. What is the, the best here? 
to the squid. Oh, these shells? Spider, spider shell. Spider shell? Ah, okay. I think we ordered that as well. Mm. But the, the meat inside is only a little bit, right? Mm? Okay. Ah, yeah, like this, yeah. Okay. Okay. Looking forward to it. Okay, let's not uh, spoil the surprise too much. See how it looks when, uh, when it arrives. But yeah, we just uh, spent a lot of time taking uh, a lot of beautiful pictures here. If you want to see some of the pictures, I will probably post them on my Instagram. So it's uh, always worth to follow me on Instagram as well if you would like to see some behind the scenes of my days. Yeah, it looks absolutely nice here. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh my god. So you call this bottle fight? Boodle yeah. fight. So boodle fight means eating or getting the food served like this? Yeah, together. You can, or if you want to have a plate also. or You, can you eat with a hand, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that looks nice. Yeah, oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, that looks really, really nice. So this is the salad, I think. This we is ordered one favorite. salad. It's not as famous as the one in Kawasaki. All right. Oh, yeah. That's not Kawasaki. Yeah, okay, we have to destroy it now. Yes, please go. <laughs> <laughs> it looks almost too good to, uh, oh, to destroy it. Really? Yeah. I'm taking the eye of Shiagao. All right. We'll take the O. Everyone gets one letter. It's two times tuna fish, right? No, the other no? one is tuna. It's like, this is the tuna. This is the tuna. Actually, it would be easier with the hands. Yeah, just use your hands. Mm. Uh, we need knives. Yeah, knife would be things. handy, but uh, it's okay. Mm, I love it. I think I tried this in Malaysia before, but you just get it out, right? Yeah. Can you maybe hold the camera? And I'm getting it out. And this is our vegetable dish. Um, ah, and then you eat all of this, right? Yes. Oh, wait. Um, you can eat all of this? Yes. Uh, no, no. Just make sure you don't eat the this part right here. Not the, the, the bottom? Yeah. Is it uh, like uh, poisonous or something? No, but it's not ed really, really edible. Mm. Mm, the weird texture. Yeah. A bit like... like uh, it's like squid, I guess. Like squid, yeah. <laughs> And gummy. Gummy, gummy. That's yeah. the word I was looking for. Mm, chewy. Mm. Yep. Chewy and gummy, yeah. Mm. Oh, lovely. It tastes a little bit like a, like fresh, like a fresh kick to it. I'm actually a barbecue taste. Mm? Mm. Oh. Fresh from the ocean. Fresh from the ocean. Yeah, this is what like those kids got earlier. Ah, right, yeah. When we arrived here, the kids... Yeah, just, just pull it. Yeah, just pull it out and then... Yeah, that's it. Mm. And just so, dip it. Dip it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have to be careful with the bones here and the tuna. The tuna is a little bit dry. Is it supposed to be like that? I think they... they it's a little they... bit dry, but uh, still it tastes really fresh and meaty. I think it's it's mm. very dense. Normally it's very dense. Yeah. I think they cooked it too long. For too long. Mm. Uh, there are some bones in here, so watch out. Yeah, some, some bones in the tuna. I guess you can just see this for... But it's really yeah. nice. I would like to put this on a sandwich, actually. That would be nice. Oh, the what? The, the tuna on the, on a sandwich. Yeah. Mm? So bottle fights are popular in the Philippines for like big events. The what? Boodle fight? Yeah. Boodle fight. So you do that when there's a birthday or a wedding. No, this actually started with the military. Mm -hmm. This is how they eat. Like, ah, okay. Like, like, yeah, on location. They put the... Like a buffet. Yeah, for everyone. And it's free for all. Yeah. They don't use the... No utensils. Yeah, and they just eat with their hands and they mm -hmm. get whatever it is that they So get. Boodle Fight is like one big plate on banana leaves and everyone yes. just shares. Yep. And usually everyone eats with their hands. Yes. And you just dig into it. Yeah. Ah, like okay, one okay. Long... All right, we were not able to finish everything. So we have a little bit of fish left, some squid left, some rice. So it was a lot of food for four persons. So we just decided we will uh, ask our boat guys. Like we have two guys uh, driving us around with the boat today. So. He is just getting the guys. They don't want to waste the food here, so we will invite the boat guys to uh, finish the meals. What's the, the total bill? 3,453? That's in, including the, the hut here, right? 
Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so total bill is uh, 3,453 for this huge meal, including yeah. renting of the hut. No, we had beer as well. All right, time to leave this island. We spent how long now? Three hours here? Three hours here on this island? We arrived, at, I think, around 11, right? Yeah, yeah. So it's now 1.30 or so? No, it's 2 something. 2, two something more. already, yeah. yeah. But that's okay. We don't have uh, any more plans, any uh, work to catch today. Yeah, so we'll just have to go to Guyam. Guyam. Guyam yeah. Island, that's it. That's the last island. The that Gu one over there. That's the, the small island over there. That's going to be our next stop. By the way, I wanted to ask you something because you live in Germany. Yeah. I was always curious, how is it as a foreigner in Germany with communicating in English? Oh, it's all right, because like, I live in Rhineland mm? and that's where most of the US Army bases are from. Yeah. So people would normally assume I'm an American because of how I speak. And normally they're like armed with English skills already because they know that there are lots of Americans in there. So it just so, so that the locals are used to uh, have people around that are English speaking. Yes. Ah, okay. Because okay. I live near Spangdalem. Yeah. And in Rhineland, they have the Rammstein, which that's is the biggest the army, army base. base. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So I think that's a Rhineland thing. Yeah. Okay. The because people in Rhineland are very nice. Are very nice. Oh, yeah. good to hear that. That uh, you have good experiences in Germany. Yep. <laughs> so the Filipino people are so hospitable to me and so friendly to me. So I'm happy to hear that you, as a Filipino, oh. have a have a good experience in my country as uh, well. I have no complaints. That's good to yeah. hear. That's good to hear. Okay, so how many years in Germany already? Like three, right? Three years. Three years, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. But uh, here for holiday because you can't get this in Germany. No, we don't have it in Germany. <laughs> but we yeah. have the Mosel River. Mosel River is so beautiful. Uh -huh. We have the castles, we have the vineyards. Oh, he really likes Germany. Yeah. Oh, yeah, nice. I, I really love my place in, in Germany, uh -huh. the, Mo the Mosel area. Mosel wine region. Yeah. We have the wine. Right. I like that you say we as if it's your home already. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I like that. Yeah. I'm at home. I'm so excited to go home next week. But <laughs> oh, you're excited to go back to Germany. Yes. Uh, yeah, go okay. home to Germany. <laughs> <laughs> so funny thing is like some like every time like I travel abroad now, mm -hmm. most of the time, I make friends with fellow Germans. Oh. Like when I was in Prague, yeah. I was traveling alone, then I ended up hanging out with some Germans. Well, and now you ended up with me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like how we met, like uh, we just met at the pier and then we thought, hey, we want to share a boat ride together. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, the Germans are here as well in the Philippines. <laughs> <laughs> like the, the Germans are kind of like my Filipinos now. Ah, like if okay. I see another German, it's like, oh, papabaya. <laughs> yeah, papabaya. <laughs> okay, so where's our boat actually? I, have I don't remember there. that we walked so far. I don't know. But it's probably just here. There was. Mm. Okay, let's Wait. see if we can find our boat. Oh, uh, yeah, it's here. Ah, this one here. Okay. Okay. Did you receive the food? The, the food? Maybe. Yeah. Okay, okay, good, good, good. I yeah, don't want to waste uh, good food here. So I'm happy that uh, they enjoyed it. All right, let's climb up here. Okay. Yeah, you brought shoes. Yeah, those are my shoes. Yeah, actually our plan was to go hiking, so oh, yeah. we were prepared for hiking, not for an island trip. Mm -hmm. Okay, off to the next island. Okay, this is actually a cool spot here. Ah, you can sit right here. We just took some beautiful pictures here as well. And wow, the view right here. The sun is shining on the face. Oh my god. This is what you think of when you think about traveling to the Philippines, right? Something like this. Ah. The funny thing is the water here is so clear, I can see the ground the whole time. Maybe like one and a half, two meters. Is this where we're going? Yeah, yeah right? Okay. There's like a tiny island here as well. What a day. Actually, the last days it was raining a lot here, but today we have the perfect weather. Wow. Beautiful. Oh, they're playing basketball there. Okay, we have a bit of a ravey situation here. Uh, it's dangerous. No? <laughs> because earlier he said it's a little bit dangerous, so we have to wait a little bit. All right, last island of the day. Small and beautiful.
Okay, unfortunately we can't stay here until sunset. That was our idea. But uh, the guys from the, from the boat said we need to leave because the waves are coming. And then it will not be able to leave anymore. So we have to leave before the sunset. The unfortunately. Yeah, guys, I wanted to fly the drone and show you some drone shot, but unfortunately my drone is not working yeah. because uh, something got into the camera, I think sand probably, so the camera is stuck. So I can't use the drone anymore at the moment. Yeah. Unfortunately, the most beautiful island, and I don't have drone shots now, but uh, that's life. What's still beautiful here. Check it out, the kids are having fun here, jumping into the water, <laughs> dancing around. <laughs> oh, funny. So we made it back and the sunset is getting beautiful here now. Wow, that looks epic. Okay, salamat. Salamat. Okay, thank you very much. It was a really nice tour. Okay, thank you, thank you. All right, the price of the tour is 2000. It's like a six hour tour. So you pay 2000 and then we were four persons on the boat. So it's uh, 500 each. And then we also paid a little bit of tip because they were nice guys. And actually, we stayed a little bit longer than, uh, than planned. So 2000 plus a little tip. We get a six hour island tour. That was a lot of fun. Okay, and by the way, Alex here, you have a YouTube channel as well. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what, what do you film on your YouTube channel? No, usually my life in Europe. So you live in Germany at the moment? Yeah, you know. How many followers do you have at the moment? Around 850 something. 850? Yeah. Guys, let's get him to over 1000, please. He's a really nice guy. Uh, give him a follow. What's the name of your channel? Yeah, just look for J Alexis. J Alex, I will uh, write it here or link it down. Uh, danke schön. And uh, let's get him to over 1000. And now we are going to uh, join some kids here. They are jumping in the water. That looks fun, right? Yeah, so much fun. You're gonna jump Bro, as well? Yeah, we're, we're going to do that. You're gonna jump as well? Uh, of course. <laughs> it's shallow. It's not yeah, how deep is it? Can a big I guy like... It. It right ah, it's really shallow. For, for the kids, that's okay. Look at that sand. Yeah. Like, oh, maybe yeah. I can't jump. It's too shallow Stay for there. me. <laughs> Check it out. They're just jumping from here. Oh, even from there. Is he jumping from there? Oh, oh! Well, I guess uh, they do that every day here, so don't need to be worried about them. <laughs> oh, wow. yeah, all okay, no problem. <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> oh, wow. Ah, yeah, local, uh, local spot here, having fun here. Unfortunately, I don't think that I can jump in here because the water is really uh, shallow. So. Looks like fun though. Oh, oh even a backflip. Oh, wow. <laughs> Can you ask them if they do this every day here? Do what? Uh, if they jump every day? Oh, yeah, they yeah. do it every day. Oh, so it's a fun place here. Yeah. I can imagine. Yeah, okay. Oh. oh, finally, I'm having an epic sunset in the Philippines. <laughs> After over two months here, this is my second. The first one was in Manila. But the first one I'm properly filming, finally. Wow. <laughs> and yeah, if you haven't seen the previous video from Chiagao, where I explored around some rural areas here in Chiagao, then check out the video right here. Stay healthy, stay positive, and then see you on the next episode. Ciao, guys.